it was definitely exciting to meet Patrick Henry for the first time. Um, you know, I, you know, I watched all these videos and you, you see all these things. I watched tons of videos before I got here. And then we, I even got to Skype with him, you know, so I got that experience. But then seeing him in person, the first night I got here, I got to see him. Um, and it's just, you know, it's, it's, you know, I was nervous to do, honestly, I was very nervous to meet him. I was nervous when I Skyped him, you know, and so to finally, to meet him was definitely, it was exciting and it, it was helpful too. You know, I get to see someone in real life, someone you're playing, it's definitely, it's, it's exciting. Meeting our counterparts has been an absolutely wonderful experience. All of, everyone that we have met uh, have been absolutely wonderful, great to talk to, and we're, and we've even seen them shoot some of the scenes from the movie, and they've been doing an absolutely fabulous job with it. Well, let's see. What, what was it? What was it like meeting Patrick John for the first time? Um, he uh, he did not disappoint. I'll say that he certainly did not disappoint. Um, I felt that we connected and hit it off immediately. Gosh, Burgess is such a good-looking guy. I was never that good-looking, so I, <laughs> I'm tickled to death. Talking to Patricia was so fun. I, I was nervous, like I was meeting, you know, getting ready to talk to a celebrity. She'd been so built up in my head as just this kind of perfect uber mother. Meeting Jama Williamson for the first time and get to know her a little bit. She's, she's a wonderful person and, and beautiful on the inside also. And it's just um, really nice to meet her and to, to learn a lot about her. You know, it is truly a, a wonderful experience being on the set where our story is told. You know, it's truly amazing that our, our story is being made into a movie when we, we look at it and think, you know, we're just doing what any family would do, you know, living our lives as we know we should, trying to be good, ordinary people. Patrick Henry was born with a rare condition. He was born without eyes. The art process for Patrick John is, um, <laughs> uh, it's, it's a big curve. He starts off in a place where he simply doesn't know what to do. It's not out of anger, but a hopelessness, a helplessness. And through allowing the people around him to inspire him, his, his wife is, is a rock, a model for him. His son is, I think, everything he wishes he could be, because in him he finds the strength to do what he's supposed to do. That part of his journey is uh, so touching as he allows Patrick to motivate him to bring out the best in him. And so uh, he finds himself at this crossroads of sort of a sink or swim. And then in using his own gifts, he challenges Patrick back to, to be his best. So you find Patrick John going through this journey of reconciliation with who he is with his family, with maybe who he thought he was supposed to be, with who he finds out he really is, um, his faith. It's, it's enormous, it's fantastic. Patricia is the, um, I find her to be just sort of the epitome of a perfect, beautiful mother. She is strong, but also vulnerable. She puts her kids first. Patricia sees the potential in people, including her husband. She has a lot of faith, and she just trusts that the goodness in people will come through. So talking to her on the phone was so great. It was my first real connection to the actual human being. What struck me first and foremost about her was how strong she is. I mean, it comes through in her voice. And something about that little, you know, that Kentucky twang and, and the, and the the gravitas in her voice really that was the first thing that I thought, oh my goodness, this woman's strong. And so that, that helped me a lot, sort of find her, you know, and tune in to what it is that, that makes her her. She also told me something really interesting about her riding on the back of the motorcycle and bringing Patrick along, you know, in the sidecar. I think her, one of her cousins is in a biker gang. And so she has, she has like experience, you know. And so I was just like, she's just cool. She's cool and she's tough and I love her. <laughs> that was my impression. <laughs>